ECMO saved my life. There was no hold. ECMO saved my life. Was Lou like something? Was my primary care diagnosed with pneumonia started me on antibiotics. The antibiotics weren't working, and within three days, I was really bad. Where I was, I would stand up, pass out. From there, they intubated me, and then I was out. Before we were moved to Renown, we were told that my dad had like 24 to 48 hours life expectancy. I don't know. Being a 19 year old ready to go to college, having to say goodbye to your dad is quite uh, the difficult experience. We got here on July 1st, and on July 4th, Dr. Stallman said, you know, we're going to try ECMO. And by the evening of July 4th, while we watched fireworks out the window of our ICU room, the ECMO started working. So for us, I think our comeback story started here on July 1st. ECMO is a machine that provides life support to folks with severe cardio or pulmonary failure providing oxygen to the body when a patient's native body can't do it on their own. So it's reserved for the most critically ill of patients. It works by draining blood from a vein, passing through up the ECMO pump, which then sends the blood through a membrane lung, which adds oxygen to the blood, removes carbon dioxide, and then returns the blood to the patient's body. Having ECMO available for renown in the community is really a blessing. Up until last summer, patients who had life-threatening illnesses would either be managed with conventional management until it wouldn't work anymore, or they'd be transported to Sacramento or Salt Lake City, which are the two closest ECMO centers in the region. For renown, it's been a wonderful journey to work as a partner to help expand ECMO capabilities to provide that service across northern Nevada and to provide that service closer to home in a safe manner so that way patients don't have to go out of state to get ECMO care. The Helmsley Charitable Trust aspires to improve lives through exceptional efforts in health grant making and in place-based grant making as well. The Rural Health Care Program works to improve access to health care. And that's really what our mission is, to really provide the best of the best so you don't have to leave Reno. We serve all and we provide the highest quality care. So it's been a three and a half year project. Thank you to the technology of ECMO and thank you to the Helmsley Charitable Trust to fund that for us, was able to save a life in our communities. We didn't really have a chance until we got here. He was not going to be stable enough to be transferred to a place that had ECMO. So the fact that we got here the day that the ECMO program went live, we were just, we're in the right place at the right time, and the right place was by your own. I was able to kind of put aside that grief and be like, I'm gonna get to say goodnight to my dad. My dad's gonna get to watch me walk across the stage at UNR while I graduate. And the Helmsley Foundation brought it here. We're so grateful to them. It was wonderful to get to meet Darren and his family, to be able to connect with the patients that are served by the funding that we're able to provide. These are the people why we do the work we do, in order to try to give as many people as possible a shot at life. One of the things our trustee is very passionate about is ensuring that no matter where you live, your zip code doesn't determine the outcome that you have or the quality of care that you can receive. There's so many rural places where if you find yourself in a position where you're sick enough to need it, you're not gonna have to go far and you're gonna be fighting the fight of your life with home field advantage and we wouldn't have ever cared i don't think until you need it and then it's the most important thing in your life and we for sure are grateful we're grateful to the nurses and the doctors and the respiratory therapists and the physical therapists that put us all back together an incredible team gave us home field advantage we won we won I think we're a lot more appreciative of each other now because we know what there stands to be lost. I call it a miracle. Yeah. Yeah. Miraculous luck. I'm Darren Sloan. I'm Megan Sloan. I'm Abe Sloan. We're the Sloan Three. <laughs>